Hey guys, welcome back to our channel, or welcome if you're new, I'm V, and I am so excited for today's video. This has currently been what it's been looking like all month, and I am so for the fall vibes, and I was like, you know what? I need to go out and have such a fall day, because I don't think I've done that since fall started. So I'm going to tell you guys my plan while I finish my makeup, and we're going to go and have such a fall cozy themed day. Firstly, I want to go fall book shopping. I have been reading The Wicked King, which is kind of fall themed, so you know what my reads have still been pretty folly um which is a really good book by the way but i really want to read the xx i've heard so many booktubers talk about it like katie is reading Haley fam and i think just ali as well so i really really want to read that book and i also want to read a spooky book i don't i don't remember the last time i read a spooky book i think the last one was verity and that wasn't even that scary at all like it was creepy but it wasn't that like spooky because i'm using a screen and not my mirror so this is gonna look quite terrible also i'm by no means a makeup guru so please don't judge so anyway, I really want to get a silent patient because I heard that one's really spooky and also really good So I want to get that one as well And I think I want to limit it to two books because I have so many books that I have not read yet Like this is my TBR shelf right now I love how I'm choosing to talk when I look crazy But this is my TBR shelf right now and there are more books on the bottom and I I'm only getting two books. And I also, guys, I haven't had a PSL yet. And I'm not like a huge Starbucks person, but their PSLs during the fall season are so good. They're pumpkin spice lattes. Literally, they taste like fall in a cup. And so I definitely need to get one of those today as well. Also, I really want to do some fall baking. I feel like baking is such a cozy fall thing to do. Plus, I haven't baked in so long and I literally miss baking so much. So I want to bake maybe like an apple crumble. I love apple crumble or apple crisp or whatever you want to call it. So I think we're going to do that as well and get the ingredients for it because we have no apples. And we'll watch something folly as well. Um, I don't know what yet. I will figure it out together. Okay, I did most of my eye stuff before, but I think we're gonna do a wing today. Okay, makeup is done and we are ready, but I need jewelry. I got my nails done black. They're a little overgrown right now, but I just think the gold jewelry is such a fall vibe. And the sponsor of today's video is Ana Luisa. If you guys have been watching my past videos, you've probably seen me wear their jewelry in so many videos because I absolutely love their products. And something great about them is that their packaging and products are carbon neutral, so they care about the environment. And also their pieces are are so high quality. I don't know if you're supposed to sleep in rings and jewelry, but sometimes I do. Okay, most of the time I sleep in rings. Is that bad? Can you comment down below if you sleep with the rings on? Because I feel like that's bad, but I do it all the time. But anyways, besides the point, I sleep in these and then I also like do dishes and like take showers with them on. So they're constantly getting wet and all of that, but they stay really, really durable. So they have really high quality pieces of jewelry and that's something that's super important for me. And they sent me some new pieces. I'm absolutely obsessed. This is the snake ring. I absolutely love it. And it has green eyes. And I feel like that is so perfect for fall. And then they also sent me this one. I love this so much, especially because it's adjustable. So I can put it on any finger that I want. And that's another thing I love about their pieces. You can mix and match them. You can stack them. They look so good together. I'll put the names of these on the screen so that you guys can get these exact ones if you want these exact ones. But I still have to decide which earrings I'm going to wear. I want to go for gold hoop moment but I don't know if I should do the big one or the small one. I wish you guys were like here real time to help me decide. These are both from Ana Luisa and they're so gorgeous. Oh my gosh I can't I can't decide. Oh my gosh that's so hard. You know what you guys I'm gonna go with the big ones because I've been wearing these ones like every single day because I'm really biased towards them because they're called the Venus earrings and that's my name and so I'm just super biased towards these earrings and I've been wearing them every day. So we're gonna wear the big ones today and I actually really really like these. But yeah these Venus earrings have been my every everyday wear. They're also from Ana Luisa and they sent them over and they are so beautiful. I love them. So we're gonna go with the big ones. We have no time to waste. Let's go get our fall on. A tall pumpkin spice latte. Okay, awesome. okay, you guys, I got the PSL finally, and we're gonna take the first sip together. Oh my god, that is so good! That is so folly. I love it.
guys, I'm so happy with everything that I got, but the sun is setting, so as much as I could have like stayed in the bookstore for hours, I gotta go grocery shopping. Not only because I want to make my apple crumble and I need ingredients, but now my family is asking me to go grocery shopping. So, gotta do that. I hate how soon the sun sets now. Like, it's 6 o'clock right now and the sun is setting, but that's Canada for you. And the total came to 86 bucks for the books and the mug. Like, that. I got three books. Ugh, gosh. I, mmm. Yet, if I could go back and do things differently, would I? No, I'd still buy all those books because you know what? I think this book shopping is now uh, an addiction. Also, the girl that was checking me out, like for my books or whatever, she said that she just read The Silent Patient and that she loved it. So I'm so excited now to read that. I don't know which one to start with. I feel like I have to start with the X-Hex because it's more like Halloween-y and it's like October 20th or 21st. I really don't remember. So I feel like this one is more of a time crunch one. And then I know I didn't say I'd get the final gambit, but I just had to because I forgot that it was out and I just like it's so fall looking so I feel like it needs to be a fall book but yeah I think this the order I'm going to read these books in is this one this one and this one I don't know if I'm going to try to do this all in like a few days or what not but like yeah definitely going to start with this one and I'm so excited and I actually love this mug like it's so cute I collect mugs by the way so this was a must shopping and I can't wait to spend a cozy evening doing some more cozy fall things so before I do that I want to clean my room because I don't know about you guys but like my mind feels scrambled if my room is a mess and my room is a mess so I'm gonna quickly clean but I'm gonna listen to some fall music um my sister my twin sister Serena has really good Spotify playlists and she has one called trail mix which to me is kind of folly because it's super chill and like calm so I think I'm gonna listen to that while I clean my room and I'm just gonna feel so much better when I come into a clean room after I'm done baking so I'm gonna clean my room and then we're gonna bake. And then I think I'm gonna read while the apple crumble's in the oven and then I'm gonna watch a movie with my apple crumble and it's gonna be a fall movie. Stay tuned to find out what I'm deciding to watch. But yeah, let's clean. done the apple crumble that took so long it takes me so long to bake and, and cook I don't know why I'm just really slow in the kitchen but it's in the oven and we have about like 45 minutes to read so I'm super super excited I think I'm gonna make some tea because I'm actually hungry I didn't really like eat dinner which is not great um but yeah so I'm gonna have some tea um while waiting and I'm gonna make it in this mug which I think is the absolute cutest mug ever and honestly I think a mug is a good purchase because it's part of my collection and I will literally keep these mugs for 
forever. So no regrets there. And this is so cute. And I need a foam mug. I don't have one yet. So this is perfect. I think I'm going to start with the X hex. Like I said, I'm like really, really wanting to read the silent patient. But I think, like I said before, since like it's almost Halloween, this is like the perfect book to read first. So we are going to read the X hex by Erin Sterling. And I'm super, super excited. I literally don't even remember what the back was about. And I kind of want to go, I like going into books and not knowing what happens because then the plot twists are so much more exciting and like non-plot twists that are literally written on the blurb. So yeah, I'm really excited to read this. stairs but you guys this actually tastes so good it tastes so 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 good like i thought it was kind of like not made right because it wasn't like a golden brown but it actually tastes so good so the movie i'm gonna watch is let me show you actually ba -ba -dum -bum, twilight apparently it's a really fall movie and i'm 20 and i still haven't seen twilight and i feel like so many people had this movie as part of their childhoods like you know the whole team jacob team edward thing or edward yeah edward and i haven't even seen it and i'm not gonna lie i have my presumptions but also heard a lot of good things about it and people are like you just need to give it a try and some people really love this movie in fact i think my sister said she watched it like multiple multiple times my younger sister so i'm gonna watch it tonight and see how that goes and i think it's such a cozy fall vibe from the looks of it obviously i don't really know but yeah so i'm gonna eat my apple crumble and watch twilight <laughs> Hello. 